Oh. Hey Kim, what's up? Hello. I just punched the table. Well, that wasn't very nice of it's, you. It's, Be gentle. We have fragile friends in our ooh, company. Look at my diamonds. Nice. Aren't Those they are lovely? Very nice. They are lovely. Yes. But ooh. you know what's lovelier? What? <coughs> Mine. Oh, oh <gasps> that my, is beautiful. My lovely diamond. I know. Oh. I know. Go away, peasant. <laughs> So Kim, how are you doing today? Just dandy, how are you? I am doing quite well, quite well. So what are we playing with today? We are playing with the Twisby Diamond 580. Or Ooh. the 580 AL. Yes! How did you like the Twisby <gasps> 580? You know what? Funny thing, I own one. <gasps> you do! Ooh, Ooh, you, that's the 580 AL and turquoise, right? Yes! If that's not lava lampy, I don't know what oh is. Oh my gosh, do I'm the so motion. excited. Here we go. This is oh. like, we haven't had a lava lampy pen in so long. This one is clear. Yep, and this one, I mean, this one's clear too, right? Yeah, so the section. The section on this guy is aluminum, and the yes. section on that guy is uh, clear. clear. And then down here, is there a difference? Uh, I don't believe so. Yes, th these are clear. Oh, and there's aluminum here. Yeah. Okay, oh. Oh, look at you go. Detective work. But the cool thing about these is, so there's two col two regular colors, yep. and they both come with steel nibs. Mm -hmm. Yep. And this is the funky part. So the clear. Lay on the funk. Kim's got the funk. She's got the funk. <clears throat> the clear comes in extra fine, fine, medium, broad, 1.1. 1. 1. Stub. Stub. Yeah. Woo! And then the other one, this guy, right? Yes, comes in extra fine, fine, medium, broad, and that's it. And that's it. The stub's gone. Yes. Stub, you're out of here. But? But you can buy replacement nibs for mm -hmm. these. There are several different Twisby pens. Yep. You can't like grab just like any old Twisby nib and put it in here. It has to say the Twisby Diamond mm -hmm. 580. We were unsure on that actually. Yes. Brian and Lisa were actually on their way out of the office. And, and we're like, like wait, what? question! <laughs> Forget which one said it, but on the way out, they just kind of like faded off into the distance. 580s, a 580s, a 580s. Yes, yes. And they just walked away like that. And yes, just off into with the those sunset. words of wisdom. Yeah, on their horses. <laughs> they were, it was on a beach. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> if you could see the floor right now, my pina colada's over here. <laughs> the barrel is faceted. Initially, I thought, Maybe oh, Maybe like the should... cut of a diamond? Ooh, that's actually yeah. very accurate. I guarantee that's what it was. I'll give you Don a minute Jason, to catch up to like, idiot. <laughs> how, how advanced I am oh, in my thinking. Oh, well, apparently. <laughs> so it is larger than an eco, a little bit pricier. A little bit pricier. But not like, <gasps> Times two pricier-ish. Yeah. So back to the facets on this yes, thing. Yes, okay. Especially when you have ink in there, like on that guy, like when you move it Pull around. Pull up to the light. Yeah. Get your sunglasses though. It's really cool. It's just like as if, if you had like um, light on your diamond or something. Like oh, yes. in the display case. We should have these downstairs like constantly twirling. <gasps> One thing I always like on the uh, on the Twisby pens, uh, whether it be on the Eco or whatever, their logo or like their little it's not really a logo, is it? Like their design. Their... It kind of reminds me of like a secret society. Yeah, Illuminati. I'll it's very, it's very cool. It's almost like it's like floating in like a glass or something. And you can see the nib through this, which is awesome on the yes. cap. And the the cap, we should point this out because at first I was like, is my cap like dirty? There's like mm. a little like, like a inner s cap. Yep, a smoky cap. Yeah, a smoky cap inside the cap. Probably to prevent it from drying out, but I wish it would have been clear as well. Did you post this pen? No, and I hope you didn't either. No, I didn't. Yes. I did not post it. Good. Because you can't, or you, you should. Well, you can, but. Oh, can you? I've you never even tried. I've been too afraid. But you can't. You oh, can, no, you no, can I don't post want to. It. Don't. I didn't push it on here very hard. This is very lightly, just to okay. show that it does indeed go on. But you don't want to post it because, for one, yes. it could potentially crack the plastic on here. These, this is the yeah. only Twisby pen you don't want to post. And also, it's uh, it's a piston filler, which yeah. we haven't talked about yet. Fun. So the fact that it, if you did post it on here, don't do it. It could actuate the ink, so or actuate the uh, the piston rod. It holds like a ton of ink too. Can but you get a whole sample in there? Not quite. I, I think put you on the spot. So I I have a bottle of Robert Austin. Australian oh, Sky, all right. and I just you love that question. Yeah, like wow. I use this up because it's a stub nib, so it like uses yep. a lot of ink, and then I just like see that ink bottle volume just go down, down, mm -hmm. down, 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 and with every like fill, it's just like the fact that you have that guy there. How often does Twisby come out with special editions? Okay, so long story short, they come out with special colors. They go really fast. Yes, okay. Oh um, my gosh, yeah. yeah. It is just like, like they arrive and then yep. they are gone. And I was lucky enough to grab this. Don't take it apart. Don't take it apart. No, we Didn't should you take yours that. apart? No. Miss Smarty Pants? No, I didn't. Thought I I had to and I, I didn't, I but um, mm -hmm. yes, I didn't. Likely story. <laughs> Diamond one for my diamond, diamond two for my diamond, three, four. What are you doing? I'm gathering. It's still not cool. Oh, aww. 
much better.